Hey everybody, JR Species here with another pack break video and today we're doing the 1993 BBM Japan Nippon League baseball cards. I'm pretty sure this is the only video on YouTube of a pack opening or box opening uh, on this set. You just can't seem to find uh, anything on this set on YouTube. So I'm happy to have bought this box and I'm happy to be able to bring this video to you guys. Uh, just a quick uh, note, I do sell these individual packs on eBay. Uh, my eBay store link is in the description. Um, for those of you who don't know a lot about this set, this is an iconic Japanese set. This has the original Japanese Ichiro Suzuki rookie card in it. And I'm very excited to open this thing. Uh, I had this thing sealed forever and I was waiting until I sold a pack on eBay before I broke the seal because if nobody ever bought them I wanted to have the box sealed but now that somebody bought one I was able to open it ship that pack to that man and now I'm gonna open up some for you guys so a little bit about this set here I'm gonna put a, a picture on the screen with a little bit of uh, information here you go alright so this set has um, the Suzuki Ichiro Suzuki rookie and like I said it's also got Hideki Matsui's rookie. It's got like five Hideo Nomos. It's got Kaz Suzuki. Uh, it's got a Shinjo rookie, I believe. And then uh, there's a, a few other notables that played in the major leagues. Uh, and then there's a lot of great ball players that played only in Japan. Uh, so if you're a fan of the Japanese league, you'll know a lot of the guys that are in this set uh, that have some value uh, outside of the U.S. Uh, but obviously we're chasing the Suzuki. So let's take a look at this box now that I got the seal broke It comes with a nice little store display uh, Everything's in Japanese, so I don't understand the language at all obviously and I'll just start right, right here So it's got a really nice uh, long skinny display poster uh, Like I said everything's basically Japanese except for it says baseball cards um, uh, Interesting right there on the front of the display poster is a uh, looks like an American player uh, as you guys know, um, the Japanese league is not only um, exclusive to Japanese guys. Uh, they they take guys from all around the world, just like the major leagues. So a lot of times, uh, major leaguers, if they don't get signed, um, if they get like released and they don't get signed right away by another American league or American or national national league team, they'll they can get picked up by the Japanese league, uh, or they can go play in any other professional um, venue that they want. Uh, here's a, a little paper I'm guessing tells you about the product. The only thing in English again is like the BBM 93 baseball cards. Um, I'm guessing this tells you a little bit about it. And uh, I don't read Japanese very good. Um, so when I say very good, I mean not at all. <laughs> uh, looks like this is, I'm guessing, is the checklist. Again, I don't read Japanese, so I don't know. Uh, I think this is possibly the uh, inserts that are in here. So that's pretty interesting. Alrighty. So it says this is a 498 card set. And then I also find 510. I think it was on the... Yeah, it says a total of 510 baseball cards. I'm wondering if the last ones are uh, checklists and stuff. But here's a look at the packs. Okay, pretty cool. Um, very cartoonish logos um, down there on the bottom of the teams. So pretty interesting. On the back of the pack, it's got uh, Hideo Nomo and uh, Atsuya Furuta, I think. And then over here, it looks like it's got the uh, odds, or at least the list of the inserts that you can get in here. Pretty neat. There you have your 1993 and then a bunch of other stuff. <laughs> so without further ado, we're going to open this pack up and see what we got. It says 200 over here. I'm wondering if that's the weight of the pack. I have no idea, guys. No idea. But nice foil pack here. Tamper proof. And uh, we're going to open up our first pack of 1993 BBM. 10 cards in a pack. 30 packs in a box. So you get a total of 300 cards. Which means that opening this box does not guarantee you um, anything. <laughs> Does not guarantee you um, an Ichiro. I, I guess BBM must stand for something along the lines of 
I'm, I'm guessing baseball magazine BBM so all right there's the back of the cards no idea who this fella is until I look at the front there's the stats Looks like he played for a long time 63 to 82 I'm guessing he's a manager I would guess so take a look here okay scratch card good luck I'm wondering if these are one a pack I could probably tell if I could read Japanese I don't know who this guy is if he's anybody oh wow these look a lot like um these look a lot like 1991 pro set football doesn't that look like a lot like 1991 pro set football pretty interesting Yasutaka Hironaga interesting Katsumi Hirosawa or I won't try to read all the names for you guys there we go pretty cool stuff uh, that's the dragons but if you look it looks an awful lot like a Dodgers uniform pretty neat in fact it's got Dodgers font also but it says dragons there's a nice landscape card so these cards are actually a lot nicer than the uh, and it says rookie rookie insignia <laughs> buffaloes with an ES that's pretty interesting um, these are a lot nicer these actually have a gloss on them uh, unlike the 1991 pro set or the 90 pro set for that matter football cards okay another rookie here very nice cards so these packs go for a pretty good chunk of change there's a affluent 19 Masaki Seto, I guess. I'm not sure. Um, yeah, these packs go for pretty good money. Um, I'd like to buy some more. I'd really like to pull an Ichiro. I don't know how many of these I'll open, but uh, for you guys, I'll open a couple today, okay? Let's take a look at the backs of the other cards here. There you go. Nice look at the back with a little bit of Did You Know. That's got his. Looks like his height and stuff. I'm sure that's in uh not in uh American like 171 centimeters, 74 kilograms. So you have to do the math there. 74 kilograms is about 2.2 pounds to a kilogram. So he's about 160 pounds ish. And I uh, I don't I don't really want to do the rest of the math there for the centimeters and stuff. What's it two and a half centimeters per inch? You have to do the math there, guys, find out how many inches tall he is, and then figure out how many feet. <laughs> Looks like he was born May 27, 61. So interesting. Look at the year, then the month, then the day that he was born. Card numbers on the top left. Little did you know in Japanese. We'll do a couple packs of these guys. You can pause on the backs of any of these that you want. Alrighty. Pretty nice cards. Looks like good uh Good uh, quality control. I think I didn't really get a good look at the uh, the centering. I wasn't paying much attention, but uh, top to bottom is what you're going to look for on these. So, but yeah, can you see that nice gloss? Nice gloss. Like these are beautiful pack fresh cards. Okay, we'll do one more pack for you, just because these are kind of pricey, and you guys know I don't have the kind of subscribers to get an ad revenue yet. So, take one more pack. Open her up, see what we get. I will be keeping one of these packs for my uh, unopened pack collection, though, for sure. All right, a checklist here. Let's see if we got Ichiro on it. Uh, let's see. Mm. Nope. Okay, take a look. Another scratch card here. There we go. He's on the fighters. Nice, I like the colors. You got pink, orange, red. There's a manager card, Masaki Mori. There's a rookie card. Looks like the rookies are possibly in the back. Affluent 19 again. Not sure what that means. Yutaka, this might be an older one, 
Let's see. Looks like he quit playing in 88. 447. So I'm guessing they've put like legend cards in here of some sort. So, all right, guys, there it is. So, no Ichiro's been pulled yet. So, if you're interested in buying any of these packs, they are on eBay and they'll stay there until I get done, <laughs> until I either sell them all or I open them all for you guys. So, let me know what you think in the comments below. Hopefully, you appreciate this video. Uh, you guys know I. I'm not a great big fan of opening expensive stuff uh, because when you open stuff it loses its value unless you pull something huge. Um, so um, this video is strictly a gift to you guys so you can see what it's like to open up a pack of 1993 BBM Japanese Nippon League. Alright you guys have a great day. I'll talk to you soon. Later.